Hey everyone, so today I wanted to talk about pull up and pull down resistors that we use in GPIO. So resistors come in multiple form factors, but basically it's any resistive material. Um, so I've gone ahead and used a pencil to draw a resistor and it turns out that the drawing itself has a resistance, it conducts. Uh, we can use that for our, the rest of this demo. So first I wanted to talk about the pull up resistor and so basically what happens in the pull up is we have our VCC and we connect a resistor to our VCC and we're measuring this voltage right here at this point and that's going to be the same as our VCC going through this pull up resistor. Now down here we have our ground which is at zero volts and it goes up to a switch or a wire and when that wire connects then we have a wire all the way to here. So then this point becomes zero volts instead of VCC. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. Um, so here's our voltmeter. You can see the voltage over here. So if I just look at the voltage of the black wire, we're at zero. If we look at the voltage of ground going through this wire, we're still at zero, not surprising. If we look at the voltage coming off of our power supply, we're basically at five volts. And then if we look at the voltage coming, going through a resistor, we're still basically at five volts. At this point, we're five volts. So we're using this, we're going through VCC, through that pull-up resistor, and we're right here. Now, if we take that wire or the switch and we connect it, then as expected, our voltage is zero. So when we open the switch, our voltage is high, and when we close the switch, our voltage goes to zero. Hopefully that makes sense. So next up is the pull down. Okay, so for the pull down, we have our VCC going to our wire, and then we have our ground going through our resistor, and so the point here is still gonna be the same as ground. So we're gonna still be at zero volts. And then when that wire connects, then this is just a wire, so we're gonna be at VCC. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. So you can see now that the resistor is pulled down, so the resistor is on the downside of the circuit. So we're gonna go ahead and measure here at ground, and at ground we're at zero volts, as expected. At the top VCC, we're about five volts. So now we're measuring from ground through our pull down resistor. So we're right here and we're still at zero volts. And then we'll go ahead and connect that wire and you can see we're at five volts. So zero volts, five volts. So now when the circuit is open, we'll get a zero voltage. And when the circuit's closed, we'll get a five voltage. So that's pull up and pull down. Okay, so now I wanted to look at what happens when we don't have a pull up or a pull down resistor. So here, we don't have a resistor going from ground, pulling it down to our point, and we don't have a resistor from VCC pulling it up. And you can see our voltage is just kind of jumping around. Now, when the switch from our positive line gets connected, sure, we're, we're at five volts. So when we connect it, we're at five volts. But when we're not connected, our voltage is jumping around. And then our ground, similarly, when we connect it, we drop down to zero volts. And then when we disconnect it, we're jumping around in voltage. So this jumping around may get read as a logic high or it may get read as a logic low. Um, it's also really susceptible to other power supply and things going on nearby. Generally, you want to either use a pull up or a pull down unless you are using logic gates that are either going to be connecting to the high or the low and, and there's never an open. So in summary, you should use a pull up or pull down resistor unless the pin you're connecting to is already providing VCC and ground and never does a float. I hope you found this video interesting. In the next video, I'm going to look at the internal resistance of the flipper for the pull up and pull down and how we activate that in our code. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below.